New tonight, a visitor in Estes Park is recovering after being attacked by an elk. Happened Sunday. Now, you reporting Mar Marcy Bowden took the picture just before the man was attacked. You could see how close he is to the animals. Now, the man injured was hospitalized with bleeding in his back. This happened off Highway 34 near the Estes Park Visitor's Center. Elk are being seen all over the foothills, including right here in Evergreen, because it's mating season. CBS 4's Matt Croshall is live in Evergreen tonight. Matt, one officer had her car damaged from an animal. Yeah, you know, that officer definitely uh, knows just how dangerous elk can be, especially right now in mating season. I want to show you, this is a statue, but it's pretty, uh, pretty close to the actual size of what these bull elk look like. So you can see I'm about 6'2". These are big, about 700 pounds. You do not want to get, of course, this close, but even 10 or 15 feet away, they can view you as uh, something that they want to charge. Relaxing on the front lawn of an evergreen church, a herd of 500 pound plus elk keep an eye on shutter bugs inching closer and closer. And he's checking the car out there. It could be a, uh, that's a type of situation you don't want to put yourself in. Uh, if you're going to stop and, and look at them, don't pull up five feet from them. Mark Techmeyer with the Jeffco Sheriff's Office says even his deputies have a better understanding of just how dangerous getting too close to these majestic animals can be following a recent run-in with an angry bull in Evergreen. While she was parked in her patrol car, there was a, a cow and a, a bull uh, near her, and the cow wandered too close to the patrol car, and the bull looked at that as uh, a threat and charged. That deputy was not hurt, but as you can see from these pictures, the patrol rig needed some TLC. They're very spontaneous beasts. Right now, they're even more unpredictable. Techmeyer says mating season increases the chances an elk will become agitated. Uh, the bull elks can be highly dangerous. They're highly protective, just like was proven with our deputy. That balance between getting a great picture and being in harm's way could be just a few feet and the difference between life and death. And Cardo Parks and Wildlife officials tell us anywhere between 15 to 20 feet away from an animal should be safe. But again, it's all about that animal. And if they start noticing you, you're still too close and you need to get back because that elk might charge you. That's the latest from Evergreen. Matt Croshill, CBS4 Mountain News.